Good morning, Destiverse. Pull up a lounger and relax as I walk you through the 37th version of your location and recommendations. As you can see, we are in the tower. No special events this week, just good old fashioned Jur. E3 comes a week closer, Radio Press Gaming getting more hyped. Just found out last night that I gotta make appointments to go see certain things while I'm there. I'll be doing some of that today. But first, and more importantly, our Operation Supply, supply Drop, Operation Hero Hype, will be happening tonight, starting at 7 p.m. So don't forget to stop by and show your support. Even just stopping in, saying hi, sending us a tweet, hashtag OP Hero Hype. Anything you can do is much appreciated. Good morning, Jure. Let's see what his squiggly face brings us today. Ah, B-Nonsense's favorite exotic gauntlets. The ACDO Feedback Fence for the Titan. The Active Contact Defense System uses Warsat hull materials to store a re retaliatory charge. Taking damage from a melee attack deals damage in an area around you. They're pretty neat, but useless I think, but B loves them. For the Hunter, we have the Graviton Forfeits this week. Doesn't matter how good you are, if you stay out there too long, you're not coming back. Not the same way you left, anyway. Tevis. The Graviton's uh, exotic, they grant Shade Step. I used to use it a lot in the beginning. Um, yeah, it's, it's worth picking up if you don't have it. Probably the most useless chess piece in the game. The Alchemist Raymond. To reshape the world piece by piece, thought by thought, all it takes is a little reshuffling of particles. Um, the exotic perk is a chance to gain glimmer on primary ammo pickup and with full super orbs recharge with full super orbs recharge grenade and melee. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't use it. I have them. I never use them. Um, I actually haven't been glimmer farming in forever, but I guess if you run out, you run out. They're neat to have if you run out, but other than that. Uh, the plan C. Good fighters have contingency plans. Great fighters don't need them. Um, great fusion rifle. If you're a fusion rifle user, this is a great one to have. The legacy engram this week are body armor. Yay. And then of course you have your glass needles, your three of coins, your heavy ammo synths, your purple, purple, not purple, not purple, purple goo for your sparrow, green goo for your sparrow, and your motes of light. Um, nothing too exciting, but uh, Plan C definitely worth picking up, and Graviton Forfeits definitely worth picking up as well. Hopefully they have all of their um, systems fixed for this weekend with uh, Trials of Osiris. With the stream, we have a uh, Trials of, uh, of Osiris Lighthouse carry starting tonight at 11 o'clock. Um, we have some special guests tonight. Uh, we'll be playing Warframe for a bit. Um, we have the one of the developers, or somebody from the studio, I should say, from Warframe. We got an indie game tomorrow. We got a bunch of Overwatch coming. So uh, the stream's going to be pretty amazing. And we're also using a brand new technology um, to stream the Trials of Osiris Lighthouse Run. And we should have uh, two points of view um, live and in real time. So uh, it's pretty neat. Anyways, everyone, have a great Destiny week. Thanks for stopping by. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. And uh, stop by RadioPressGaming.com for all your gaming news, needs, and wants. And uh, the Dads of Destiny.net. Great bunch of guys if uh, you're a dad looking for a clan. Take care, everyone.